Good morning. The time is 9 a.m. September 1st, 2021. The news headline. Buhari ignores governor's call for audit. Approves payment of 418 million suspicious debts. The news in full. President Buhari is against the governor's protest and calls for a forensic audit into the suspicious judgment debt. President Muhammad Buhari has approved the payment of a controversial 480 million naira in Paris Club refund related judgment debt to six creditors, ignoring the Nigerian governor's objection to the legitimacy of the claims. Premium Times on Tuesday exclusively obtained a finance ministry correspondence asking the Debt Management Office, DMO, to commence issuance of a promissory note to the creditors. The means of payment approved by Mr. Buhari. The development is against the governor's protest and calls for a forensic audit in the suspicious claims of the creditors. The debtors has accrued from court judgments awarding the creditors as consultants and contractors various sum of money accounting to about $418 million. Some of the creditors claimed to have earned their shares of the money through consultancy, servicing, services of helping states and local governments to recover funds over deducted by the federal government from their location between 1995 and 2002 to service the London Club and Paris Club loans. Others were purportedly engaged to execute certain projects in all the 774 local governments in participation of being paid from the Paris Club funds. The Association of Local Governments of Nigeria, Algon, said the contract were largely unexecu unexecuted. Premium Times had a series of exclusive reports exposed wide-ranging legitimacy issues, including non-execution of agreed contracts and backdoor deals raised against the indebtedness from various quarters. The Kayo de Fayemi led Nigerian Governors Forum, NGF, Algon, and the Economic and Financial Crimes Commission, EFCC, had in separate correspondence to relevant authorities expressed concerns about the indebtedness. The Equity State Governor, since taking over as the NGF Chapters in 2019, has been seeking a review of the humongous indebtedness, calling for a forensic audit into the agreement leading to the court judgment. In February, the National Executive Council, NEC, led by Vice President Yemi Oshibanjo, and as the 30 state governors and some top federal government officials as members, also threw its weight behind the NGF demand for a suspension of the planned payments for a forensic audit to be done. Subsequently, in April, the NGF through its lawyers, Femi Falano, a senior advocate of Nigeria, wrote the finance minister, Zainab Ahmed, asking her to suspend moves to begin paying the money as it was set to file appeals against the judgment. The presidential approval, despite concerns, the fresh documents obtained by this newspaper on Tuesdays shows that President Muhammad Buhari has shoved the issues raised by authorizing the Federal Ministry of Finance to issue promissory notes to the creditors. The promissory notes, as reviewed in our report, are to be funded through deductions from states and local governments' monthly allocations over a period of 10 years. Citing Mr. Buhari's approval letter dated January 11, 2021, the letter signed by the Permanent Secretary, Federal Ministry of Finance, Ali Ahmed, obtained by Premium Times, Ask the Debt Management Office, DMO, to issue the promissory notes to the creditors. The letter dated and received by the DMO on August 12th, the state sued authorization to issue promissory notes in favor of Category A judgment creditors. 
I write to convey the approval of the Honorable Minister of Finance and Budget and National Planning for the Debt Management Office DMO to issue promissory notes in favor of Category A, judgment creditors in reconciled list of judgment debts in compliance with various court orders and judgment and approval of Mr. President. You will recall that Mr. President had in a letter dated 11 January 2021 approved the issuance of promissory notes to liquidate various categories of judgment debts to which category A, B1, B2 and C against federal ministry departments and agencies, states and local government councils. The time is 9.05 a.m. The analysis. Just of recent, President Muhammad Dubuari has ignored the governor's call for audits and um, approved a payment of 418 million suspicious debts. There is a controversial uh, refund related uh, debts to about six creditors, ignoring the Nigerian governor's object, uh, objection to legitimacy of the claim. The creditors said that they have actually uh, they are consultants and contractors and they have done some works for the 774 local governments and also the state government and that they are being owed that money and they have been to court and also written to respective authorities and now uh, the governors under the Nigerian Governors Forum, led by Kayo Defayemi, NGF, and also the Economic and Financial